here's what I really think of Israel. I feel alive. Mitchell Trench calling, the song is called I Feel Alive and it's by IMRI, Im Imri, um, and he was a backing vocalist if you didn't know <laughs> for 2015 entry and 2016 entry and I know this because I have read it and on top of that it's on his music video. I didn't like that they just like I don't know. I wasn't a fan of it, like, sneaking in, like, if you didn't know, I mean, you said I was a backing vocalist for Eurovision a few years. No. So, um, the song is good. He is very good vocally, has really strong voice. I think that it's a little generic. It's, uh, doesn't have anything super hooky. Like, I feel alive. It's a hooky bit. So there's nothing majorly hooky, and I think that... He's trying, unlike 2015, like Golden Boy, that singer was really confident and kind of like groovy and cool. Last year was really vulnerable and just really confident as well. Imri is a little bit like, it looks a little try hard, but he is a really good vocalist. I really like how he sang it. And I, you know, it's just a bit like, too prepared. It was a little over prepared. I, I hope on the night he'll like go crazy. He did when he did the high note and he was like going higher and higher belting and then I was like <gasps> Breaking me to pieces. And then he just went into the chorus again and I was like oh I would have loved for you to like go up an octave higher in your belting. Oh, that would have been magical. It would have just been such an incredible moment. But I really hope that they, he trills around the choruses a bit because it was all a bit book standard and repetitive and just over prepared. So for me, not one of the best, but it was a very good song and he's a very good singer. So I wish him all the best. And here is my leaderboard, which you can check out and my preferences do change from time to time. And, and that's it for now. Please like, comment, and most importantly, subscribe to see all my Eurovision reviews. Until next time, bonsoir Europe, and goodbye.